Hi, Nina from Nina K Photography. Would you like to create templates for your Instagram story without even leaving Photoshop? If you've got 15 of your favorite images that you have taken from a recent photo session that you want to show as a video in your Instagram story without having to upload each individual image, this is a perfect way to do it. The possibilities and are uh, endless of in terms of style, uh, what music that you would like to add, for example, you can add text. The your imagination is the only limit that you have. So for example, this is a very basic one. I had just have 15 images that I wanted to create for 15 seconds. One image, one second per image. Very basic. So this is what the actual template looks like. You can see that each image the duration is one second as you can see from when I click on it is only one second now let's get into creating a template for you to use for your Instagram stories file new I've already saved a document, so height is 1080, uh, width is 1080, height is 1920, create. Now to view timeline in Photoshop you go window timeline and that'll bring up the bottom tab for your timeline. Now I did 15 uh, images, I created 15 images for this 15 seconds. Again the reason why we're creating this template is that it makes it easier if we want to swap and change images out, if we want to add a new design, if we want to add text, but we, we've got the basis to work with. So create video timeline and this is what it looks like now to create each layer you can do as long um, as many as you like I've just create I'll create um, I'll create four just for this one for now but I did create 15 for, for the other one so just keep creating as many layers as you would like now for to make sure that each layer doesn't change in time convert it right click convert to a smart object now that they're all converted to a smart object I can then drag this to the duration that I want and as you can see uh, one second move this one along the time One second. Get the gist and just move it along to there. Okay, done. Alright, now to add our images, we go and double click on that layer and it brings up a new tab in Photoshop, File, Place Embedded, okay, Place.
hold the shift key, transform, move that across and there you go you have your first image in your video timeline. Now what you can do is you can um, for example if you don't want it to take up the whole the whole dimensions you can put it in the middle add a new layer so treat it like any other Photoshop design if you're creating design make um, the background white add text um, obviously don't make the text white like I just did Black. recent work for example very quick but you understand concept you could um, now with the actual uh, text you can make it um, move expand change the opacity of it change the um, how it um, enters into the frame for example one I've done earlier with book now so any call of action that you would like to add to your story so I've done a book now into here and you can just add a little slight bit of animation and it looks like your still images are turning into a bit of a video so back to this last one so we go file save close that layer if you like go back into what we just created here we go and there we have it now like I said I could add a little bit of motion to this I could do a zoom I don't think I want to resize to fill canvas and I've added that motion so I'll just go back and have a look spacebar to click and see how it just slowly moves in all right same again over to your layers double click on it file place embedded I'll produce this one file save close it open it up open up the correct one and there so we now have our two images from there on and you can keep building this and the reason why however but what I would suggest before you start adding all your images is to create the template that for your story for your Instagram story and then you can start adding and save it and then you can start adding your images so when you come you've got a blank template to work with and each time that you want to create a image or to create a, a to create a story for your Instagram using your images you have that template to use and you're not reinventing the wheel the same time every time so to render uh, to save your video for Instagram 
so here we have the finished one and this is what it looks like file export render video um, and then you can resize it and again the document size is 1080 by 1920 and there you have it you can create professional videos for your Instagram story using your images without even leaving Photoshop you can treat your images exactly the same as you would any um, with styles you can um, make the opacity change as it comes in you can add text you can add music the possibilities are endless and if you're already changing your images to fit into these the Instagram story dimensions and you would like to create a quick video then this is a fantastic way to do that and you don't need any other software apart from Photoshop. Thanks for watching and don't forget to hit that subscribe button.